Hello everybody, welcome back. I'm that role-playing ginger. I just had myself a nice little lunch of some chicken strips with some honey mustard, and I took some Tums afterwards because I know how that grease is going to mess with my stomach. But we are back. I am ready to continue on with more of Pokemon Violet. I am hoping, beyond a sh shadow of a doubt, that the stream stays in this time. Um, it only seems like it split three times from the from the VODs that I saw. Uh, downloaded those, so I will be having the first of those up potentially later tonight. Uh, and I'm going to be, hopefully, heal this up so I can get my, my whatever it's called, terrestalizer back. And just to make sure everyone's nice and fresh. Before I go climb the steps. Yeah, I know about that. Oh, forgot to turn the phone off. Or at least turn it on to silent. Let me see about checking that. <clears throat> there we go. All right. My Terra Orb is all charged. Wonderful. Time to climb the steps and continue on with my Pokemon journey through Paldea. Oh, these are the wrong steps. Those are the steps I'm looking for. Yes, this is the team thus far. I gave an Everstone to my Pichu because I want my Pichu to stay a Pichu and stay adorable for its entire existence. Ooh, combi! I didn't see that before. Alright, but yeah, I'm gonna go up the stairs to the school so I can then hopefully continue on with the adventure and get to new spots, get new outfits and everything like that. Cause I'm not, I, I'm not digging the school uniform that much. I don't, di I don't, I, I'm not a conformist, I don't like it. No, I want my character to be all gothed out, that's why I got myself, well, at least emo-ish. I got myself some, some, basically some vans, and some black socks and black gloves. Yay, he's, Rock Rock's here. What is that? Oh, oh, look at the, um, 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 oh god, what's your name? What is your name? Pit of! And over here. Give me an insight into what other Pokemon there are. Is that just a sleepy rock rough? Oh, that's adorable. Alright, anyway, continuing on. <clears throat> and I'm hoping I get to use, um, uh,. Me ride on? Me ride on, I think it's what it's called. Here we are, Genji. Welcome to Yuva Academy. This here's the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes at the desk behind me, and those halls off to the sides lead to all different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose and battle here, but for some reason they banned Pokemon battling in the main entrance. Master Genji, Miss Pneumonia. I keep wanting to call her Pneumonia. <laughs> How did you find your first school commute? We had a blast! Well, I did, at least. I imagine Miss Nimon Miss N Nimona. Nimona. Nimona? Nimona's high spirits helped with that. She's a true asset to our fine academy. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion-ranked student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Well, I know how to look after my friends, right, Jinji? Well, you, you left me alone. You sent me out into the wilds on my own. It was downstairs in the front gates. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. That's quite the news. Are they still found to be found out there? Actually, Gingy flexed on him and ran him off. You don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try and help a fellow student, Master Gingy. But you might wish to show a bit of restraint as you find your feet here at our academy. And Miss Nemona, do, no do remember that the school staff is here to resolve any such troubles. Uh, right. Yes, sir, Director. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say? I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I'm relieved to hear she's come to class, at least. Ah, and Miss Nemona, if you would be so if you'd be so good, do report to Mr. Jacques about this Team Star business. As your homeroom teacher, he should be kept appri apprised of all such things. You got it, sir. Ah, but look at the time. You two had better hurry along. Classes will be starting soon. We're in class 1A, Gingy. Ooh, do I get to go up in ranks in the class? Like, do I get to go up in the classes? That'd be awesome! Is 
it loading? Yeah, it's a little choppy there. Like, look at the kicking feet and everything. Like, yeah. Yeah, you might want to patch that up, Pokemon Company. <laughs> hello, hello, everyone. We have some exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? <clears throat> See, look at that. Like, there's no reason for that kid to be, like, ranking bossing it up in the back. I suppose I should have told you sooner, but we have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom as of today. Whisper, 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 whisper. I wonder what they'll be like. Alright, you can come on in. Could I trouble you for a few words introducing yourself? Sure. Alright, I'm Jinji. So calm and collected, he's pretty cool. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you, Jinji. Alright, then who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? Me? Me? Can I ask a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? I like collecting Pokemon, honestly. That's what I like. <clears throat> Does anyone else have a question for the new classmate? I have a question. You went to all the trouble of enrolling here, so spill, Jinji. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? It's like, why you put me on blast, girl? Jeez! I want to complete the Pokedex. <clears throat> I'm Mr. Jacques. I teach biology here at the Academy, and I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat, second row to the front. <clears throat> Next to the cool girl with the beanie. Alright, you ragamuffins. ragamuffins. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Jacques, if we can ever pixelate right. <laughs> cool, get to know by exploring. Welcome to the Academy. What's with the ringing bells? A battle cloud. Oh, it's giving me notifications. Nice. There was a way for me to check the notifications. I just don't recall. Let's see, if I press up, it's all my emotes. Press right, no notices. Okay, so that's where my notices are, if I had them. If I had them! Uh, camera app isn't allowed to be used in here. This is the outfits. Um, that's not the map. That's the map. Ah! Okay. What is that? The Academy. Oh, they have little wing. Maybe these are flying places I can get to once I have a flying mount. I can now move around the school. Choose a location and start exploring. Oh, I love it. I love it. I'm gonna go to the cafeteria. <clears throat> I like school. I'm one of those people. And so this is all wonderful to me. Combies! Are the combies making foods? There's the dude! That's the jerk! Was it Aver? Arvin. Oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Uh, I don't think we've ever met. <laughs> Super calm, call him out. What? Come on, I gave you Miraidon's Pokeball. Did I forget to introduce myself? Well, the name's Arvin. No need to tell me your name. Jinji, right? Whole school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up with the president of the student council. Normally, I wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today just to talk with you. Our, our new celebrity, huh? You've got to help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. What's this dream first? <laughs> yeah, caught your interest, have I? You want to hear all about my dream, right? No. Well, this might come a surprise, but the fact is, I'm all about the picnic life, the great outdoors, the perfectly prepared sandwiches, all of it. Not half bad at cooking either, I can tell you. Right now, I'm researching new re new recipes. Yeah. Research right now. I'm researching new recipes. That is a that is a fun little tongue twister. That'll help Pokemon feel better. Real health food. See, I found this book the other day. It had a section on these about these Herba Mystica things. Basically, there's some kind of special herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as it eats them. Now there are a total of five different Herba Mystica based on what I read. Just taking a little lick of them once they've been powdered will get your blood flowing, provide nutrients, prevent aging. It'll even boost the immune system. These herbs seem like the real deal. Only found here in Paldea, and rare to boot. 
but this book says they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning that it's going to be pretty tough to grind grab a few sprigs. Because, see, Titans are... Well, I think they've got to be... Things like this. Ooh! Um, um, Dunfan. Or no, not Dunfan. Dunfan was like the little one, right? What was this one's name? Monsters of Area Zero. As a member of the survey, it's captured... Yeah, it's, it's Dunfan, right? Yeah, it's Dunfan, Gen 2. Uh, members of the survey team captured this photo photograph... Photograph? By, uh, by chance, I notice a passing resemblance to the Pokemon known as Donphan. The differences such as texture and the way it moves suggest it's biologically separate, to say nothing of its treads of iron. <clears throat> I really want to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. <clears throat> Am I supposed to be, like, being friends with this guy? Because, as of right now, I think he's a dick. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand, either. And I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that student council room. But here you waltz up. You've got to help me out with this. You'd be perfect. Sure, why not? <clears throat> nope. Wait, I don't need an answer yet. I'll just register the places where it seems that might, where it seems there might be titans in your map app for now. Quaking Earth Titan, False Dragon Titan, Open Sky Titan, Stony Cliff Titan, and Lurking Steel Titan. See. The flying type is that wing right there, which makes me think that I, all the places on my map that have it are places I can fly to, eventually. <clears throat> While I do wish that I had my own option of flying again, like in the older games, that is something I missed where I got to choose which Pokemon I'm flying around on. Um, it's alright. They've added a lot more flying locations, which is cool. It's like to each map. Bag of Stardust. We sold at a low price to shop. Give the idea some serious thought, please. Hey, the kids in here are, are well animated while they're eating. Why were the kids kicking their feet in the classroom not? A little confused. <gasps> Zora is here. Oh, I love this Pokemon. Perfect. This is Jinji, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk with you. I hope you don't mind. What do you mean, hacked? Well, as far as you're concerned, it means I'm basically in control of your phone right now. My name's Cassiopeia. But never mind that. It's all you, it's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. If that description is accurate, there's something I'd like to ask of you. Tell me, Jinji. You know about Team Star, right? Yeah. Great. I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy students a while back. They cause headaches for the school and try to bring other students down to their level, and I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. But I'll need allies to carry out this operation, and I'd like you to be one of them. Sure. No need to reply. Everyone's telling me, like, give me questions. And then when I reply, they're like, I don't need an answer right now. I'm taking off. Uh, should I be like, hey, professors, um, I'm hacked. Hi, you're right here. I got hacked, dude. Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? I'll be more careful. You don't want anyone else overhearing any personal information, after all. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. On you go, then, young man. You can hang with the crowd. I said young man. <laughs> uh, Team Star, you say? Oh, he was listening in. He's a snoop! And not the dog variety, because that one's pretty cool. Alright, so I went to the cafeteria. What is this? Oh, it's a, it's a map. Nice. I'm gonna go to the staff room because I haven't been there yet. I wonder if there's a consistency with the written language they have going on here. Whoa! Look at that hair! Her eyes are beautiful, though. 
Very well, Champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my stead. Sure thing, you can count on me. In fact, this is going to be fun. I'm glad to hear it. Good day. Who is that rocking girl in the back, though? Oh, pardon me. Oh, Gingy, hey! She looked awesome! Good eyes, she sure is. That lady is, well, they call her La Primera. She's strong, and she can do pretty much anything. She's got cool practically coming out of her ears. She's basically everything I want to be, or that any Pokemon trainer want to want to be, really. Oh, which reminds me. Remember in Homeroom when I asked what your dream was? Now, I know you said you're all about completing the Pokedex, but hear me out. You should try to reach champion rank like me. Sure. Oh, wow. Hang on, though. I've got a whole spiel I want to give you. Here, go. No. I said, yeah, sure, so you wouldn't give me a spiel. <laughs> the trainers who reach champion rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. They're pro-tier battlers. Their moves keep crowds absolutely on the edge of their seats. You have to prove yourself to the Pokemon League to officially get the title of champion. So you've already beaten the Pokemon League? And to do that, you have to do more than just take classes here. You gotta take on eight Pokemon gyms so you can and win so you can collect their gym badges. Once you've done all that, all that's left is a special test, the champion assessment. And once you pass that, then at long last you'll be a champion. It's every Pokemon trainer's dream, the coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Not to brag or anything. No, you're you're meaning to brag. I reached champion rank during our last treasure hunt, you know. Oh, the treasure hunt is a special independent study thing we've got here. Should happen soon. Our last one started not long after the beginning of the school year. It's great. You get to leave school and go have an adventure and learn however you want. Then what is the point of the school? I guess you could just say my journey as becoming a champion was the treasure I found. Maybe. I don't know if that's that. I don't know yet if that's the answer I'm looking for. I want to talk to the girl in the back. She's cool. Anyway, I've got a feeling I'd be able to get even stronger if you and I were both working at it. Let me go ahead and save the gym's locations on your map app, just in case you decide to go for it. Oh wow. Ooh, Glacierto Gym. Whoever that is looks really cool. They got the scarf and everything, and it's an ice gym. Oh, that's where I want to go. Victory Road already? Give it some thought. Alright, but first... Oh, no! No! Calling Master Jinji to the director's office, please. I want to talk to her in the back! Yes. Hi, friend! Ryford. Oh, nice. Taking time out of your day to attempt to converse with me? You must be absolutely mad. But... 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 I'm sorry, I'm not cool enough for you yet. I gotta go to the director's office. Some of those look like Japanese symbols. But... They don't... They I, The other ones around them aren't. <clears throat> Thank you for coming, Master Jinji. Have you been enjoying your time here at Yuva Academy? Yes. That is most wonderful to hear. Now you may be wondering why we would not have simply conversed earlier in the cafeteria, but let me assure you, there is a reason why I asked you to meet me here in the office. It seems that a friend of mine has a rather serious matter they would like to discuss with you. Ah, no, I'm afraid they aren't actually here in this room with us. One moment, please. Just allow me to connect us. Dude, you, you knew what you were doing. Making me look like the fool. Oh, it's that guy! <clears throat> it's the Pokemon Professor. Hello, Jinji. It's nice to meet you. My name is Professor Tiro. I carry out Pokemon research in the Great Crater of Paldea. Research with it or at a site known as Area Zero. Okay. <clears throat> the professor is, in fact, a graduate of our fine academy, as well as a splendid researcher. 
Well, allow me to get straight to the point. Jinji, student ID number 805C393. You are a student who travels with the unusual Pokemon Miraidon, is that right? Yes. Thank you, I appreciate that you were honest in confirming the facts. Who's this Chris Redfield looking mother- <laughs> Ah, not that I- I do not mean to offend you. In fact, I wish to ask for assistance. With what? Hey! Oh, how good it is to see that you are well. It is- Oh. Oh, how good it is to see that you are well. It's been quite a while since we last met. Miraidon was once in my care, you see. Still my idiot of a son. Its Pokeball was originally mine. I assumed you received it from a young man called Arvin. I am in no con no I am no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. This is what I would ask for. Will you continue looking after Miraidon in my behalf? Uh, yeah. I ain't giving it back. I do appreciate your agreement. Miraidon has been greatly weakened and is currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take on a form specialized on form mobility. In all likelihood, it will require some time to fully regain its capabilities into one bad. I will provide you with my contact information. Would you please get out your phone? I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Until then. You like how he, he walked off before turning off the camera to make it look more cinematic? Could this Pokemon have its origins in Area Zero? I'm getting suspicious about Mr. Clavel. Turo, don't tell me you actually did it. Mr. Clavel's getting like, he's getting suspicious. He's eavesdropping. He knows secrets. <clears throat> Well, it seems the professor is quite the favor to ask, or quite asking quite a favor of you. But of course, the academy is always here to support you in any way that we are able. I do hope you'll continue to enjoy your school life together with that Miraidon. Cool beans. I'm gonna explore your office now. I want to read this paper. I want to check your computer. I want to see what books. I want to see this fossil. Turn on your TV. I can't do anything in here. What is this? Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Hello. Hello, excuse me. Oh, you're still here, Gingy. Oof, getting called to the director's office. How'd you land in that much trouble already? Nah, kidding. I know it wasn't like that. Mr. Jock wanted me to show you the way to your room in the school dorms. Your very own private room, Gingy. Let's go check. Oh, please tell me I get to customize my own room. Oh, that would be awesome. Be like the uh, the the secret bases in Gen Three. Ta ta ta, Chian. From today on, this is your room, Gingy. Actually, it's as new to me as it is to you. Never been in here before. Maybe check out your new bed. Looks comfy, and you must be pretty worn out from all the stuff happening on your very first day. Oh yeah, this has all been one day so far. I'll see you tomorrow, when you've rested up. Then we can battle even more. Take care. Oh, I really hope I can customize this place. That would be so cool. It's your own personal kitchen! To the bathroom? This leads to the bathroom. Make sure you keep it nice and clean. It's your study desk. It's got plenty of space to put things. Yes. And then the wardrobe, which I can change at any time. I'm gonna check out the bed. I'm gonna call it a day. Call it a day. Reach around, get my drink. The days quickly fly by after you start your new life at Uva Academy. Then, at last, the day arrives for your true adventure to begin. Oh, so now we're having a... Oh, so that was a cold opening right there. Do you have anything to tell me in all those days none of my Pokemon leveled up and evolved? What have I been doing with my life? 
Attention all students, today marks the beginning of an important new assignment. Please assemble in the schoolyard while I'll explain in more detail. <laughs> Ding dong, bing bong. Yeah, just barge right in. It's time! Just barge right in, Mona. Yeah, well, make yourself at home. It's not like this is my room. I've been waiting forever for this. Come on, let's go out to the schoolyard. All right. Do I finally get to change clothes? Because that third one looks like Ra. The, the Katakana Ra. And the very end looks like the Katakana Mi. Excellent. It seems everyone is here. Well then, it's time that I explained your independent study assignment. As usual, the theme will be a treasure hunt! I ask each of you set out and travel the world in search of your own treasure. You have all learned much within the walls- Oh, that's another student? <clears throat> within the walls of our fine academy. But now it's time to turn your eyes upon the wider world and deepen your understanding. I see Gyarados! Explore Paldea's abundant innate neighbor. Discover the Pokemon that live there. And get to know the people too. Golduck! Where will you travel? Who will you meet? And what will you achieve? Of course your Pokemon partners will be there to help you. You will journey together. Learn new things together. Die together. Share each other's thoughts and feelings. And find something you might always treasure. <clears throat> I look forward to welcoming you all back after your independent study. When you return to us as fine young trainers. Then we will enlist you in the Pokemon military. Let the treasure hunt begin! Onward! Sweet. So now I'm hoping the world the world opens up a lot more. Some good music going on here. What the hell is that? That's like a baby version of the one I have! Cyclozar, yeah, that's what she was talking about earlier! Take care, everyone, and remember the Great Crater of Paldea is exceedingly dangerous. Entering it is a violation of school rules. Well, you know I'm going there, then. What are you waiting for, Gingy? Let's go! Okay, can I can I ride me ride on now? But I want to ride me ride on. Why am I in offline mode? I don't want to be in offline mode. L is connect to the internet. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. There it goes. Okay, so it's the L bumper. That's right, I'm still learning the controls for the Switch. Cool, that's what I wanted. <clears throat> I don't know what effects it'll have, but that's what I wanted. Yes? JJ! JJ! Yeah, I was right behind you. The treasure hunt, it's finally starting! Alright, what are we supposed to do? Yeah, fair question, since it's your first time. Come on, let's walk and talk. I'd rather ride. Can I ride? Please? The treasure hunt is a huge part of the Yuva Academy school year. The point isn't to get all us all looking for some actual hidden treasure, necessarily. We're more just taking our own adventures and see what, ha see what experiences Paldea has got to offer. You could try to beat Pokemon gems, you could help out people in need, you could hunt for real capital T treasure if you wanted, even. There's stuff that we'd never learned sitting in a classroom, you know. This is our chance to learn it. <clears throat> Plus, there are so many chances to battle, which is obviously perfect for me. You and me for sure gonna battle, gotta battle if we run into each other out there. Hope you're ready. How about now? How about now? 
What are you, a chicken? Oh yeah, battling can wait. I meant to tell you. Did you know your phone's map app lets you set yourself destinations? Yes, I did. You can try setting one of the gyms as your destination. That'd get you on your way easy. How's that for student council president? Giving your own friends an insider advantage. Uh, Arvin! Insider advantage? Sheesh, you make it sound like we're cheating or something. All I did was suggest that he check out the gyms. It's up to Gingy whether he does. Gingy's gonna have his hands full searching out Titan Pokemon with me. He doesn't have time to waste on something like chasing after a champion rank. Me and him are gonna be too busy visiting the lairs of Titans and nabbing their Herba Mystica. And the city -o? Don't go filling his head with such weird stories. Hey, all I did was invite him along. It's still up to Gingy whether he goes right. Oh, they are, they are just in... They are so hot for one another. Hey, Gingy, Cassiopa here. It's about Operation Starfall. Remember what I told you before. Team Star is made up of five individual squads, and each one's got their own base. I need you to go to each base, all five of them, and beat the squad boss there. Team Star's grunts gonna, might try and get in your way, but I'll be helping you out from a distance. And heads up to the boss. The bosses each specialize in a different type of Pokemon. Just remember the names of their crews, and you'll figure it out. Still, no need to worry. With your skills, I'm sure you're more than up to the task. I'll just go ahead and add the base's locations to your phone. God, everyone is giving me stuff to do. Ooh, the fire crew. I love that hair. <clears throat> I want to be part of the Team Star fire crew. So these are quests I'm getting, I imagine. Good luck with those bosses. I'll hook you up with some nice rewards each time you beat one. Team Star, those punks are serious hazard. They're not Gingy's problem. That's right, because he's more important things to do, like searching out awesome ingredients with me. <laughs> you three, <laughs> you're all right. I thought it was up to Gingy to decide whether he goes or not. Wasn't that what you said, Nimona and Arvin? How do you know my... I'm looking forward to seeing what you can pull off, Gingy. Bye. <clears throat> What was that all about? Gingy, I'm glad you're making plenty of friends here, but try not to get dragged into anything dangerous. Anyway, go into danger and fight the gyms! I'm I'm gonna say I think Cassiopeia, or Cassiopeia is um, the, the girl that I helped uh, at the beginning when I got here and fought off uh, Team Star. Guess I'll start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon. Here, I'll send you a pic of what the gym buildings look like. Cool. Oh, and I know we've been running our mouths, but it's your call what to do, Genji. Go where you want and do what is really what you want to do most. A treasure of our very own. For me, that's got to be my... my big dream of tracking down the Herba Mystica, that is. Once we get those herbs, I'll make the absolute best sandwich you've ever had in your life. <clears throat> hey, there's my buddy! Oh my gosh, did it come out just because you said sandwich? Oh, it loves sandwiches. I'm falling in love with this thing even more. I'll get you a sandwich, buddy. Don't listen to this jerk. Seems like it wants to start moving. Is it telling you to get on, Gingy? Oh, I hope to God so. Press the plus button to jump onto Mirrodon. You'll find you can get around more quickly. <laughs> you can press the B button to make it jump. Oh my God. Of course I'm riding it. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful, and its tail turns into the wheel. Whoa, it transformed! Now it really looks like some kind of weird Cyclozar. As long as you've got mirrored on, you can go anywhere you want. You can go pretty much anywhere. Paldeo's your cloister! Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe. Well, if you're going to search for those Titan Pokémon, I'd say head out from the East Gate. But since Gingy is actually headed to the take on some gyms, I'd say go for the West Gate. Besides, it's way too easy to get lost out east. Man, this is why I can't get along with you. I'm out of here. Catch up soon, little buddy. Wait, we're not friends. We're not friends. You're a jerk. You, you, you Charmandered this Pokemon at the beginning of the game. Asshole. I'll head to the gym. See you around, Gingy. Oh, I get to ride around on my special boy. 
Oh. Oh, look, it's so beautiful. Oh, I'm in love. Oh, I'm in love. Yeah, they said head out the east gate or west gate. I'm gonna go out the south gate. <laughs> I, mean, I actually don't know. Uh, south gate might not lead me anywhere. Ooh, item. Cool, I can pick up items while I'm riding around. Oh, he can roar! Why does he roar? Oh my god. I love it. This makes me want to go riding right now. <laughs> Hello, this is Genji's phone, right? It's me, Arvin. I'm a bit worried about whether or not you managed to set out yet. You did end up deciding to set out east, right, after leaving the school. If so, you're not far from the area where the Stony Cliff Titan is said to make its lair. Stories say it clings to cliffs, practically becomes part of the stone, but attacks from above. Though, maybe don't, st maybe don't be staring up overhead all the time looking for a titan. Only go to come tumbling off some cliff you didn't see. If that ever does happen, you can open your map app and call a flying taxi to come pick you up. Oh, cool. <clears throat> Some of those rocky areas are like a real maze, so try not to get lost, little buddy. And if you find a titan, let me know. I just want to get out of the city. I'm not making a choice about who I'm going to go with. I'm going Pokemon hunting, don't you think? I'm going to go find me some new types of Pokemons. I'm going to catch them all, and I'm going to become a Pokemon master, and then I might get around to doing your guys' things. <laughs> Pick the king. Shopping for ingredients. You got a variety of ingredients. Nice. There you go. Try making up some nice tasty sandwiches. A picnic's not a picnic without them. Since you're here, you want to kick back with your Pokemon and enjoy a picnic? Sure. Why not? Because I haven't done it yet. I want to check it out. There's a Pikachu over there. You and your Pokemon got a good rest. Come back and kick it any time. Oh, I didn't do anything special. Item. Oh. Wait. Okay, so I'm in the wild now. Okay. I didn't know. Gotta get me a Shinx. Oh, he's so cute. Uh, no, I'm not gonna crystallize. Yes, flinched and couldn't move. Perfect time for a Pokeball. Shinx was cut. Shinx Fang. The extension and con contraction of its muscle generates electricity. Its fur glows when it's in trouble. Nice. Give me this item. A Poké Doll. Nice. Okay, we got the little rickety. What is this, though? Like a tofu monster? Mackley? I don't know what it is. It looks like a rock, so I'll try a dark type. Smackdown. Okay, it is a rock type. I'm gonna bite it again. Hopefully it flinches. Nope. Oh, uh, okay. I almost thought I had a lightning type out right now, and I was like, oh no! Dang it, speed spell. Well, at least it's level 13. Shows that I'm getting into a good area. There's a Magohita! I get one more bite and then I'll throw the Pokeball. Speed rose sharply. Dodge this! I got a Knackly. I got a knackly for catching Pokemon. Sprigatito wants to learn Quick Attack. Yeah, or, um, should I? Let's see. Because Scratch is a power of 40, Quick Attack is a power of 40. I'll do Scratch, uh, yeah, scratch for Quick Attack. Because I don't want one, I don't want, I want a move that I can use to, like, slowly take out HP for a Pokemon I want to catch. 
the rock salt Pokemon. The ground, is scra the ground scrapes its body as it travels, causing it to leave salt behind. Salt is constantly being created and replenished inside Nackley's body. Send it to the box. Nice. We have a big gap missing between them, though. Between uh, the numbers, at least in the Pokedex. Which is good. It shows me that I still got a long way to go. Despite the fact that I've done a lot of Pokemon catching. Lear, how dare you. Corvusquire, what rookie he turns into? I was like, why is it in the air? Forgot it's a flying type. Rookity was caught. The females are fussier than the males. If another creature dirties the female Rookity's wings, it'll peck the offender relentlessly in a burning rage. Sweet. Alright, I need to heal my Sprigatito. There's an item right here that I want to get. A young Goose, but I don't want a Young Goose. I want a Mokuhita. Boom! I caught it off guard? Nice! Something sparkling way over there in the end. Attack. One more quick attack, and I should be able to catch it. I actually liked my, my uh, Makuhito a lot. There's a Hariyama, what it turns into. This is Gen 3. Having Hariyama in was a good thing to have because um, in Gen 3, your dad is one of the gym leaders and it's a normal type with all the slack off of evolutions, like slacking and everything. It toughens up by slamming into thick trees over and over again. It gains a sturdy body and dauntless spirit. And so you needed a fighting type to take down that normal gym. Because, good god. I remember the first time I went there, before I like knew anything was going on in the games. Uh, the first time I went there, I was like, oh god, this thing is such a hard gym to fight. Why is my dad being such a jerk? You don't understand, dad. I'm a new trainer. You're supposed to take it easy on me, dad. Uh, Leafage should be able to take him out, right? I'm five levels ahead. Nope. Try Magical Leaf on this, because I think Magical Leaf is probably... Magical Leaf should be stronger than Leafage. Oh yeah, way better. But it has Sturdy. Of course it's got Sturdy. Quick Attack. Not very effective, but it's only got one hit point left. Yay! LeChonk's level 11. What is that? I don't know what it is, but I want to catch whatever it is. It looks cool! It's like a little knight! Oh, it's a Charcadet. That's awesome! I'm gonna bite it. Astonish. Alright, now I'm gonna quick attack it. Fire spin. So it's a fire type Pokemon. Char Cadet. So it's gonna be like a fire knight? If so, that's amazing, and I need to have this thing. Char Cadet. Sweet. Azura wants to learn Slam. Yes. We are going to swap out Splash for Slam. The Fire Child Pokemon. Oh, it's so cool looking. Its fire power increases when it fights, reaching over 1800 degrees. Or yeah, 18. Yeah. 
1800? Yeah, 1800 degrees Fahrenheit. It likes berries that are rich in fat. I'm gonna check real quick because I have not completed the sword and shield. Uh, I have not completed the sword and shield Pokedex. So I don't know if this one was released in this generation. This is generation 9, so yeah, Charcodex is new. And it's awesome looking. I'm gonna add it to the party. I'm going to swap out Lechonk. So now I have a fire Pokemon in my party, and it's really cool looking. Potentially has two evolutions. A ladder leading down. Ooh, I see something down there that looks new. And is that a Stantler? <gasps> I want... Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> Well, it's not new. But I want the Stantler if I can. I couldn't, it wasn't letting me use the Z thing. Stantler's Intimidate. Okay, so Stantler's level 17. I'm gonna Magical Leaf it. Don't kill me. Oh, shoot! Um, I'm gonna run. Because it wasn't letting me do this. It wasn't letting me do the zoom, so I wasn't able to, like, see what level it was. But, oh, man, I need my Sprigatito back. Uh, restore health. Don't you fight me, little cat. I am busy. What level is that? 18. So, yeah, this is a slightly more dangerous place. So I am going to have to climb back up the ladder. Let's get out of here. I love the open worlds they've been making in Pokemon to where you can run into a Pokemon that will just wreck your face. I think it's an amazing thing that should be a staple now. This is coming from someone who is a big Soulsborne fan, though, so just be... Ooh, what the heck is that? All right, buddy, we're getting this, we're getting this. B to jump, right? Yeah! What is this? Crystals. All around Paldea, you may spot gleaming crystals emitting brilliant beams of light. If you investigate one, you'll be taken to a terror raid battle. Oh, raid battles. Oh, this is just like a giant, but yeah. Oh, cool. Um, I'm going to take my Pokemon in. It's a Magnemite, though, so I might want to change my Pokemon. I'm gonna have this, but I want I want to make sure he's fully healed. All right, and I got LP for just finding it. So, oh, it's so cool that they brought this back. Um, challenge as a group. I'm gonna let anyone join. Let's see how this works. Let's see if there's anybody out there. That's I bet there's millions of people playing right now. But let's see. Let's see how well this goes. Defeat the Terra Pokemon within the time limit. It's searching for random people online, which there's gotta be many people playing right now because this game just came out. Alright. Ooh! Uh, Risa? Risa? Oh my god, look at that. That must be the evolved form of... No, I want to change my Pokemon. That must be the evolved form of, uh... Of, um... Quaxley. I don't... It says it's two stars, so hopefully this isn't going to be too challenging for my Pokemon. But it's a Magnemite, so I chose Fire. Come on, can we get two more people? Get mad. Uh, 
That is re, and then okay, we got Noko bringing in a. Oh, I'm all ready to go. I'll click yes. Noko, re. No, that's Rio. Rio. Okay, Rio. Nice. And Mar. Oh, that's what my kitty's gonna turn into. Then yes, I'm happy. Hi, everybody! I'm ready to start the raid battle. Is it because I was the one searching? Was I, like, technically in charge of the raid? <laughs> my bad! I've never done this online. I've only ever done it in Sword and Shield with, like, the NPCs that come in. Oh, but look at that. Look at all of us beautiful people. What the is- oh my god! I'm just checking out the... Noko's Pokemon. I'm gonna fire spin. I think someone else is deciding. So I think we all have to decide our moves before they go. What's going on? It's already oh, it's already down. I didn't even get to do anything. I'm gonna try and catch it though. I hope everybody gets things for these things, and not just me. Like if they get to catch the Pokemon too, maybe. I got Magnemite. That's cool. That's really cool. Yeah, I've never done those online. Magnemite. It moves while uh, the magnet Pokemon, electric and steel. It moves while constantly hovering. It discharges electromagnetic waves and so on from the units that left at its sides. I'm gonna add it to my box. Oh, that's cool. I like it. I'm... I'm so happy. Come on. No, let me up. I want to be up! It's not letting me. Oh. I might be able to make that, but I'm not sure. What did I say? Follow the path uphill to Artisan. Whoa. Oh Ow, crap! Did not mean to fight you, birdie. Little rickety. Oh, I'm still on the back of the Pokemon! That's cool! I'm gonna bite it. Trying to get it to flinch, and then I'll beat it up. Nope, the use layer, so I didn't... I see a spoink. I see you, spoink, hiding behind that rock! Coming for you! I just, I don't think I can, I can't stealth when I'm on the back of it. Spoink, you're mine! It looks like it's already starting to get dark in the game. And it's only, it is four o'clock in the afternoon here. It shouldn't be getting too dark. I'll try a Pokeball now. If not, I can probably do one more quick attack on it. Got it! Sweet, three levels up. Wait, my kitty just hit level 16. Maybe it'll evolve? Spoink's data. The, br the bounce Pokemon. Using its tail like a spike, it keeps its heart beating by bouncing constantly. If it stops, it dies! Jesus. Oh, my hand is acting up again. Uh-oh. 
What? Sparagatito is evolving out in the wild. Oh, here we go. First evolution of the game. Oh, she's cute. I like it. It's got a little mushroom growing out of her. Congratulations, your Sprigatito evolved into a Florigato. Oh, she's cute. Florigato, the grass, the grass cat Pokemon. The hardness of Florigato's fur depends on the Pokemon's mood. When Florigato is prepared to battle, its fur becomes pointed and needle sharp. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it so much. All right, now that I got Florigato, uh, I need to. I want to put Charcadet in front so I can get Charcadet at some levels too. Charcadet needs to fight Grass type or Steel type Pokemon. Ooh, there's an item over there. Cause it's only it's only Fire type, right? Oh, another crystal. Was that always there? Did I just pass that up like a dummy? Oh, it's a Pineco! Uh, I'm going to challenge as... No, I'm going to challenge alone. So I get NPCs, just so it takes... It's less time. And it'll let me have a better idea of what um, what's going on with the raid. Because I, I don't know what happened last time. I think I think the person with the evolved Quaxley got a hit in and just demolished the Magnemite before I could do anything. You guys have a big old Pineco. Charcadet, so cool. You try to defeat a Terra Pokemon within a time limit. If your Pokemon is knocked out, it will be revived after a while. But you'll also take a time penalty, so try to avoid letting your Pokemon faint. You can also perform a special action in Terra Raid battles, cheering. By cheering for your side, you can do things like boosting the stats of Pokemon on your side, or helping them recover their health. You can do it three times per battle. Alright, so I'm going to battle, I'm going to fire spin the Pineco. Wild Pineco is trapped in a fiery vortex. Charcadet avoided the takedown. Ember. Pineco used rollout. Oh crap. That's super effective. No, Charcadet! Ooh, this is rough. Can I use the terrestalizing? Terrastore after one attack. Okay, so I need one more attack and then I'll be able to do it. I thought Fire Spin was going to actually hurt Pineco. It, looks, it doesn't look like it's getting hurt by the Fire Spin, I don't think. It may be. I just saw the thing jiggle. Alright, let's see how this works. Oh, it's got a big old chandelier on its head. I love it. Or a candelabrum. No, not on me. Dang it! Oh, Chase, Brooklyn, and Hunter, we need you guys to keep doing this. This Pineco's a little tougher than my Pokemon. Ten seconds until revival? Why aren't they... Are they hitting him? I'm gonna cheer. Uh... Pull all out. Which will boost the tax of everybody. Attack and special attack. Good. Can you roll out on me? Take me out for 15 seconds, I'm gonna guess, because it was 5 the first time, 10 the second time. Yep, 15 seconds. But I boosted their attack, so hopefully they'll be able to get some hits in. If they decide they want to do anything. Do they have to wait until I'm back too? Charcadet!
Boom! Okay, we're down in the red. Knock me out again, though. I'm probably not going to make it back for another turn. Oh, I'm still up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Victory is ours. I'm going to catch me a Pineco. Gathering all that stardust. I wonder if, cat if these Pokemon, the special ones like this, have um, better stats. I'm not sure if they do, but I'd be curious to see it. We do get a lot of items from them, though, so that's cool. So there is that is an incentive enough right there. If it's if it's a Pokemon you already have and but you can get items from it like that, so that's that's good enough incentive. I don't think you get experience for it though. You get the uh, Pineco, the bagworm Pokemon. It spits out a fluid that uses to glue tree, tree bark to its body. The fluid hardens when it touches air. Send it to there. And that's gone, so you also get... You get you get the, the league points for finding the things, right? Alright. Hey, you! Wanna fight? Hey, new kid! I know what's up around here. Let me take a look at your Pokemon. Sure. Martina? Is that Martin or Martina? Martina. Whoa! Yeah, fish. I love this little dude. This little dude. Look at him! He's got fire eyeballs, too! Everything about this guy is awesome. But I am going to swap out for Floragata. Oh god, it's got Peck. I forgot a lot of fish have Peck. Uh, Magical Leaf. This is one cool cat. <laughs> She's like, whoa now, whoa, calm down. That was legit hilarious. But the fact that your Pokemon got wrecked? I hang out here and get some more uh, healing? No, I don't want to talk to Pikachu. I have a Pichu. I'm better than you! Yes. Okay, so my Pokemon should be healed. That's the healing sound. Sweet. It's over here. Item. Pokeball. We'll revive. Max Heather. There's a cave. Frame mate's getting a little bit of a dip. So that's something that we'll need fixed. What is that? That is a poke. That's a shining Jigglypuff. Is that a shiny? Like, is it a shiny, or is it just something special about it? Level fourteen Jigglypuff. Like it's glowing, but it's weird. Oh, oh! It's terrestrialized. <laughs> Can I catch it while it's terrestrialized? cannot catch a Pokemon while it's terrorist. Oh, that answered my question. Reduce its HP to break through the transformation first. Okay. I feel like I can do that. Um, it's a normal fairy type, so I'm going to Ember. Not very effective. Um, why is it not very effective? I burned it, at least. Why is, not, why is fire not very effective against a... Oh, it changes its type. That's right. And I see water spouts coming out of it. Ah! Starting to pick it up. Starting to pick up the pieces. Okay, so I have Thundershock on Pichu. That's really good. Pichu is three levels below this thing. 
starting to learn. I'm starting to use my noggin. So Jigglypuff uh, terrestrialized into a water type. So when is it going to lose the terrestrialize? So it's to do damage to it. Does that mean I have to knock its HP all the way down? Or do I just have to get it down to a certain point? Because it's still there. I don't know if I can not kill it now. Put it down. Oh. There it goes. Okay. Gotcha. Did that make it lose its turn too? Oh, nice! Boom! Got me a Jigglypuff. So now I got an Igglybuff and a Jigglypuff. And a lot of experience points. Very nice. The Balloon Pokemon, Normal Fairy. If it inflates to sing a lullaby, it can perform longer and causes sure drowsiness in its audience. Very nice. Because now I know giant shining Pokemon means that they are going to... That. They are going to be uh, terrestrialized. Oh no, I wasn't trying to run into you. Uh, super effective astonish. Oh god, faster than me. Come on, don't. Don't defeat me. Dang it! I wanted the experience for Charcadet. Uh, choose the next Pokemon? Yeah, I'll use Florigato and bite it. Biting it'll take care of the thing. Azuril leveled up. Very nice. I need to restore you with a revive. Alright, now I want... Oh, wrong button. I want um, Charcadet to level because I want to see what it turns into because it looks really cool. So I'm going to give it experience candies. I'll use all ten. 8,000. Oh, God, it's level 20 now. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Will of the Wisp? Yeah, I'll swap out Fire Spin for Will of the Wisp. Well, maybe. Yeah, I'll swap out Fire Spin for Will of the Wisp. <laughs> Nightshade. Yeah. I'll get rid of Astonish for Nightshade. Is he a Fire Ghost Knight? Oh, that's gonna be so cool if it is. Um, I'm gonna give this one XP candy to my Pichu. Make it level 16. Wants to learn Nuzzle. Nuzzle's a lightning type, but it's weak. It, do it guarantees Paralysis though, but I do have Thunder Wave if I want guaranteed Paralysis. Nasty plot, and no. uh, like I said, I don't use those. Uh, slightly increases the base points for defense stat. Nice. Very nice. Well, yeah, now I got a level 20 Shark Dead. <laughs> Did not expect that. Yeah, right now it's just a fire type. It's terror type becomes fire. So I'm going to, uh,. I'm going to swap Charcadet with Florigato. Oh, I thought there was a Pokemon behind me. It's just a tree branch.
I'm just running around exploring and having a great time now. I don't have an objective as of right now other than catch all Pokemon that I don't currently have. Flash cannon, nice. The Pokemon? Yeah, that's a uh, one of them. No, I wanna, I wanna go down the thing. Kia! I do like that it's instantaneous, but I don't like that the frame rate takes a dip. Hello? Ooh, can I go swimming with this thing? That was like a Psyduck down there. Oh, this is the bad spot. <laughs> this is the bad place. I mean, I could probably go down there now that I got a level 20... 20 Charcadet. It's probably not gonna listen to me. I don't know how that rule works in this one. Because you can choose whenever you want to go to... No, not the Pikachu! Eat the Pikachu so I can don't have to talk to the Pikachu. I want to talk to the dude. Um, but yeah, I'm wondering how the rules are for Pokemon listening to you in this game are. probably should go find a gym and take on the gyms. But my main primary goal right now is explore and catch. Antidote. I think these items do randomly pop up. I'm finding a lot of them. Is that another char? Char? It is another one. Uh, Charcadet. Yeah, I'll battle you. Why not? It looks like you're ready for a beating. Dun 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 da dun. That's the sound of healing up. Dun 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 da dun. It is. Good on you. You did a good job. Alicia, the musician, sent out Igglybuff. Uh, just magical leaf. It probably won't take it down in one hit, but oh, it did. Never mind. Ignore me. I defeated the musician. Why do all the trainers only have one Pokemon? Thousand one hundred and money, nice. Like, yeah, why why do all the trainers only have one Pokemon with them? I see you sparkling on the ground over here. Thank you. <gasps> hey, Jinji. So from what I can gather, the Stony Cliff Titan likes to lurk somewhere in this rocky area. I had a look around, but I couldn't find any trace of it. Maybe it's way high up on a cliff or something. No, nah, that's impossible. I don't think it'd be hiding anywhere somewhere that tricky. So don't go falling off any cliffs and trying anything to search it out somewhere too strange. Maybe just give your map app a look if you're feeling stumped. I'm not doing your job right now. I'm, I'm busy doing my own thing. Like catching this little bear. Kia! Oh, it's adorable. It's only level 8, so I don't want to kill it. Maybe bite? No! What have I done? I have murdered the boy. Ooh, a gulpin. Boom! Alright, get a 
bite the gulpin. Oh god. Um, I'm gonna try and catch the gulpin right now, otherwise my Pokemon will fall asleep after the next turn. I mean, it's not too bad. The Pokemon Center's right there. But it's cool. I managed to avoid it. I managed to avoid it by just catching the thing. Sweet. Uh, no, we don't need Faint. Tarantula. Is it evolving? Oh, no. Gulpin, the stomach Pokemon. It has a small heart and brain. Its stomach comprises most of its body with enzymes to dissolve anything. Pokedex has been updated, very nice. But I want that little little Palmire guy to come back, that little bear. I didn't want to beat it, I want to catch it. Great Balls! Great Balls are my go-to Pokeball. What is this? Oh, there it is. It's, a little, it's my little boy. It's my special guy. This one's three levels higher than the other one, so it probably won't die from a bite. But I'll quick attack it just to be safe. Okay, good. I can't quick attack it again, though. Pokeball, go! Palmy was caught. Wonderful. Ralts leveled up. Ralts wants to learn Draining Kiss. Oh, is that a fairy type? Because I know it's a damage and heal. Yes, it is. Um... It does 50, so my voice is 40. I'm going to do that. It is the mouse Pokemon. Oh, so it's not a bear? It looks like a little teddy bear to me. The pads of its paws are electricity discar discharging organs. Palmy fly fires at flyers. Electricity from its four paws while standing unsteadily on its hind legs. Where do you want to send it? To the box! Perfect. And this person looks like they need beating up. Battle me, for I am mighty! Oh, they definitely need beating up. <laughs> Severino! The office worker. Oh, 17, so this might actually be an okay fight. Stockpile one. Thought I was hearing something in the house. Weird. Special offense is up, so that's not good. Hey, my buddy's on. <laughs> he might be trying to do what I was trying to do, so I'll probably I'll give him a text here in just a moment. Let him know. Hey, you can't use Pokemon Home with. Uh, just a heads up. Scarlet and Violet might not have Pokemon Home until early spring. <laughs> uh, he's about to send out a Skiddo. Skiddo's a little. Um, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna send out Charcadet. See if Charcadet will listen to me. It's level 20. We'll see. I'm going to Ember. Ember is the color of your energy. Orenberry? Yep, Orenberry. Oh, leftovers. Nice! Can I have those? I could probably buy them, but I, I want them for free. It looks like he's listening to me very nice, so that's good. Charcadet goes to level 21. Azuril gets to level 14. My might and my items mean nothing in the face of a mighty trader like you. 
2,720 monies. <gasps> Azurel's evolving into Meryl! Yay! Oh, you're so cute! I love you, the Aquamouse Pokemon. The oil-filled tail functions as a buoy, so it's fine even in rivers of strong currents. I love it. Love it when a plan comes together. 